Hey y'all, it's me, Eleanor, and it's that time of year again. Yeah, here comes Peter Cottontail hopping down the bunny trail. And I've got some information about what kind of Easter candy is available out there. I found some cute things um, and some things that um, I look forward to um, sharing with my nephew and enjoying myself. Remember, you are never too old to get an Easter basket. It's okay if you're a grown up and you still want one, it's okay. All right, so some of the things that I found that were really cute, I found this bunny bubble gum in what looks like a little plastic carrot. And so, got several pieces of um, eggs here, got several eggs, and it's actual bubble gum, and it comes with some stickers, so, well, the sticker thing is trying not to come out, there we go, stickers that are quite cute, and so, the gum, the gum's not bad. The gum is not bad. I would recommend this one just because it's just adorable. And um, yeah, you don't want to give just chocolate, but keep in mind, chocolate's very important. Chocolate's very important. All right. Um, found some Pez dispensers that are bunnies. These are really cute. They also had one that was a little chick. I, I don't understand the chick having anything to do with Easter. I mean, well, I mean, why the bunny too? But the little chicks maybe um, produce the eggs and the bunny is the distribution part of the operation. I don't know. But I thought these were really adorable. And there's some other um, bubble gum eggs that I found. And there are more of them than this. I've already pulled some out because I had to do some quality control checking last night. Okay, I was, I was feeling it. But each of these little things, and there's some, I think five or six of them. But this holds 12 pieces of gum. This gum was actually really flavorful. I really liked it and the flavor lasted a while. Not really great for blowing bubbles if that's your goal. But flavor-wise, nice, I liked it. I look forward to uh, dipping into that again. And Nerd's Rope, it's got hopping on it, and looks like there's some bunnies on the wrapper, but no bunnies on the actual nerd rope inside. And it's it's a um, rope of putty, it's edible putty. So you don't have to like eat it off the rope. You can just bite the whole thing. Not as good to me as when the nerds are in a box. The flavor it's even more intense, but this is good. I like this. It says tear and share, so you really could break this up among several people if you didn't want to be a pig and eat the whole thing. And um, something else I recommend, these Lifesavers mints that are orange flavored are awesome. They are really good, good flavor. And Jolly Rancher jelly beans. They pretty much taste like Jolly Ranchers, but they are in a little jelly bean. Pretty much the Jolly Rancher flavor you like. It just maybe a little strange that it's chewy. 
But you're probably used to just sucking on those. So, one other thing. Russell Stover came out with, I think they've been out, I've seen these years before. With egg caramels. This is pretty much the only chocolate I bought. Last year, and I got all this from Food Lion, by the way. Um, last year, they had a lot of more variety. I'm going to go out maybe to a couple more places to check on their Easter candy. Uh, maybe go to Walgreens and Lowe's Foods. Because um, I definitely, last year, those different kinds of chocolate bunnies that I found were really um, good and interesting. You might want to check out my previous um, videos on that. So, this is a Russell Stover caramel egg. Hmm. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm not sure if I taste I did one of these last year or not. I don't think so. The caramel flavor is really good. The chocolate. I actually, before I like read the label to it, I kind of just grabbed it. Um, I thought it was like a Reese's peanut butter cup, which, if you're from around here, you don't call them Reese's peanut butter cups. They are Reese Reese cups. Reese cups. And that's what um, I thought it was gonna be like. But no caramel; it's not quite peanut butter. So it does it does have a good caramel flavor, though. I really like this stuff. I'm gonna have to give it away. This stuff can't all stay in my apartment. Anyway. Um, I'll just close in saying that while, you know, we talk about the Easter Bunny and we get Easter baskets and we give them as gifts, let's remember that we got the greatest gift of all, that Easter is really Resurrection Day. And um, so I hope that you'll keep that in mind with all the other festivities going on. And so I hope you all have a happy Easter or happy Resurrection Day. Bye.